Good morning, audio storytellers. Uh, Nate here to talk about the four universal elements of effective stories. Number one, character. Number two, setting. Number three, conflict. And number four, resolution. So, first of all, your character. Who is this story about? Doing a quick character sketch can be helpful to get clear in your own mind, even if all those details don't make it into the story. Who is this? Who is this person? Where did they grow up? What's their family life like? What do they look like? Where do they live? All that stuff can help give you the background you need to bring this character realistically to life in your podcast. Number two, your setting. When and where does your story take place? So whether it is your own bedroom, a hospital bed, or the bed on a spaceship, thinking clearly about your setting and including the right details will bring that to life. And you can even think about sensory details, sights, sounds, smells, touches, whatever, to give your listener a mental picture of your setting. And then third, and perhaps most importantly, your conflict. What is this character up against? What are they battling in life? Is it, it could be something physical. It could be the weather. It could be climbing a mountain. It could be their own body. It could be society. It could be the expectations for people like them or their profession or how they should go about their life. Uh, or maybe their conflict is in a relationship with their parents, a best friend, or a mortal enemy. Um, more, more clarification about your conflict and what your character has to lose is the key to pulling people into your story. And if the answer is not much, then dig harder and find something more compelling for your character to lose, to pull your listeners in. Then finally, resolution. Maybe they get the girl or the guy at the end of the story. Maybe they climb to the top of the mountain, or maybe they just get to a new sense of themselves. Whatever your resolution is, figuring out what that is will give your listeners a satisfying sense at the end of that story that it has gotten somewhere and that they've learned a lesson from this story. So again, character, setting, conflict, and resolution. Clarify those in your own mind and whether you are just recounting an anecdote from your weekend or planning a seven-part fantasy series like Harry Potter, your stories will be more effective and pull listeners in. All right, see you next time.